that is a serious problem uh, ladies and gentlemen ibrahim april 2nd uh, of course with me uh, you know i have uh, the people's power i get cash box i get come recorder we're gonna hit this floor again going you know them guy there yeah and i like a uh, uh, above them they no one cool water so i see now they go so no more but i don't blame myself i don't blame umaru fofana because they like that umaru fofana with the sit up and fine in the civil society them marcella samba we don't take appointment as peace commissioner that they can't see them back and fine but anyways ladies and gentlemen always always know say we can look for you know um first of all we get the, the, the countdown to the elections. Now, now I know why Marcella Samba already pushed the agenda for the local council elections next year. Because they don't set him out. They don't get a peace commissioner. Apart from the fact that she's the, 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 the director or executive director or CEO or whatever title is for the campaign for good governance. Where the, she has been funded by by, 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 by uh, 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 European Union. Get hundreds of thousands of leons or millions of millions of leons. But they, 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 they can conduct elections across that country. They were not elections per se, but for sensitize and educate people about elections in the country. Now, now we know why Marcel Samba set him out. These are the issues. Now, so Umaru Fofana, it was the COVID ambassador. We don't know. Now, Paso Africa Express promised for we give pull details them. Now, they tell we find out so Umaru Fofana, the COVID ambassador. But you know, Sierra Leone them, the APC as a party, it's about time we're going to take on the Umaru Fofana. Umaru Fofan has to be exposed. The BBC has to be exposed because enough of their foolishness and then policies need to be review, reviewed again once more. But ladies and gentlemen, we, we, we ask the gods so again, the people of Makini, the Makini massacre, the, the people of Padamba Road prisons, the Tombo, the Lonsar, all the killings, the human rights violations across the country. Today. When I see how Umaru Fofana, they left the important thing away from making news and they go talk nonsense when it's not even news. Because even like Kisoya, not on news and it's not even warrant news. But Umaru Fofana, because this guy, it is sabotage with democracy in our country. This guy, it makes you say, it want for destroy that small democracy we are unfit for. We get 10 year rebel war, people have lost their lives them. The same as people go to Bush, then go take gun and cut people and cut people and foot. Umaru Fofana, they fan the flames and the embers of division of our country. Umaru Fofana is very unpatriotic. Umaru Fofana is one of the Sierra Leoneans, the way they really, what would they say, people that not deserve for if they call themselves Sierra Leoneans. Umaru Fofana is one of those people. And guys, we're going to take on Umaru Fofana today. This message now for Umaru Fofana. You see, because whatever we're doing in life, we have to have what is called integrity. And, and, and journalism come with integrity. Because without integrity, journalism is nothing. And Umaru Fofana has betrayed the trust of the people of Sierra Leone over and over and over and over again. And first of all, kudos to Mayor Akisoya. We're not getting a platform. We're not getting an audience. And like how they talk, um, we, we, we don't blame them. We don't blame SLPP. Now, when the APC, again, we they give them kudos at this point because we see say that they make really good strides them. We see the move where the APC they make. But again, there is a lot of loose hands that needs to be tied up. And that is why we're going to keep pounding and keep coming at these issues. You know, ladies and gentlemen, uh, 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 today is a beautiful day. God is good. Now tell God thank you for your life. We give all the glory, give all the praise. You know, our Ramadan month, I can't begin so. And I offer caution people and say, just because now Ramadan month, not means say everybody get for going to that holy holy grill. Because matter of fact, if not so they live with life, where Ramadan can they tell they be the most uh, 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 studious and assiduous Muslim, it is a problem. Also, the only thing I do for be that kind, we should always, you know, carry ourselves as uh, Muslims or as Christians in our faith, either, either way, for make sure say yes, we represent the true meaning of our religion at every point in time. So I want to caution people and say, where Ramadan they come not mean say, all man then go, this government goes to run and do certain things, people then begin to use Ramadan as, a, as an excuse, not for take action. It should not be that way. Ramadan, the month where we get for reflect, but at the same time, we don't go allow them guys there get away with anything we don't have for put come, uh, come through with this Ramadan. Knowing, say, and thinking, say, they go take advantage of the people of Sierra Leone. Umaru Fofana don't disgrace journalism. Umaru Fofana, the actual news, them, the incidents, the way they happen. Now, Kailau, they didn't kill Labobosu. Umaru Fofana could not call BBC for report, report that take a kind today. Across the, the continent in Africa, any country where a kind today be, they post violence election and they, they, they report them, they talk at the BBC. Umaru Fofana, they say na freelance, women say they not work for BBC. So they choose and pick what they report. Some people, it's about time the APC 
the opposition, only the people them. Umar Fofana has to be clamped down on very, very hard because this is about the truth and the truth now go last and the truth now go prevail. Umar Fofana is nothing but a big deceiver. Umar Fofana is a liar. And I can't tell you, Umar Fofana is jeopardizing a democracy. We've worked too hard, Salon people them. We don't come out too far. There's been too many lives lost, too many blood shed, too many hands cut off, too many feet cut off. Too many pregnant women in Belen, they open them. For now, Umar Fofana, they play and toy with, with democracy. That is what Umar Fofana is doing now. For now, Umar Fofana, get your death city for even think about reporting I Ivana Kisoya, where he, she did nothing wrong. There was no crime committed. Oh, uh, you know, Comrade Koita mentioned something about the fact that Usa would call the APC to task now. And Comrade Koita will elaborate Sandy because I'm pointing someone. The fact of the matter remains. APC has never blown anything out of proportion. The SLPP, they go to machinate uh, 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 an issue. Then they count them. Because Umar Fofana is in their pocket, he has been compromised. He has been paid. Umar Fofana is a, he never accept bribe. Umar Fofana is a crook at this point. But we know so it's only a matter of time. The facts shall come out. We know so who can I already talk to Una? The revelation no more now we wait for. Umar Fofana, one day the APC not blow anything out of proportion. And I don't blame SLPP. I don't blame Umar Fofana. Now the APC as a party and the opposition them. Now they are blamed. Now Makiri they didn't kill people and so. Now one gets a Umar Fofana reporter. He has never done a, back, a, 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 a thorough forensic investigative journalism. For go back to Makiri, go follow up with the people them. The lives that were lost. The woman they waited, they waited, they lost, they, they not lost their man them. They picked not lost their papa them. He has never gone back. If not the APC, Umar Fofana for a still report on Makiri. If for a report on Palem, Massacre. Now I didn't go and ban that 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 the 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 the, the, the watch group. Now that the prisons watch group, then ban them for going to Palem Road prisons anymore. Umar Fofana not report it to the BBC. These are the things that are making news. Why is Umar Fofana bias against the people of Sierra Leone? Salon people them. This is you versus the Umar Fofana now. Because whatever going to BBC, now in the world Yeri, and when the world Yeri am, and I make news, and it, we know say even Akisoya was not news. It should not have gone to the BBC. And Umar Fofana in the civil societies and Masala Samba, they all don't compromise. Masala Samba, it is a conflict of interest for you as a civil society organization for taking an appointment from the president. It means they try to shut you down and they don't shut you down because we see say you're going to get a little bit vocal. But I don't go inside you, Masala Samba. Come on, go ahead and come on in. Because this, now Umar Fofana versus the people of Sierra Leone at this particular point, enough is enough. We fought for a democracy. We want for maintaining democracy. And Umar Fofana, they jeopardize the democracy in our country. Today. Go ahead, Comrade Kota. Good morning, fellow Sierra Leoneans. It depends to the past of what we did. You know, as soon as I to go, I don't talk. This democracy, we don't, we, we, we don't find it as soon as you pull and go to push for Ali Kabaz and others, the SLPP party. They don't go as a party, but they go as individuals. They go form a revolution where they can't say they can't pay for it. It's of speech. They say they like to protest, demonstration, oppression, suppression. They put it in tribalism. And so, all that things that 11 years, people have died. And then, who are they? Kill the kill them. Born out there. And today, people them. We don't see inside almost 20 years, we get a very good peace. We get a very good tension of government from opposition to from the incumbent and opposition, I will not see any political threats happening within the SFP to APC and the for 10 years, peace, no but not in life, no of threat, and all the other things. Then we see people, they, they, they behave like they are real, so they are like Umar Fana. If they give report of them, two ten, three ten per week, they defend them, we, we, we don't even for reporting, report on them. We don't see in this short term, in three years, we government no change. We don't see the high level of political tension. We don't see the high level of corruption. We don't see the high level of intimidation. We don't see the high level of tribalism, nepotism. We don't see the high level of intimidation. All not in news. Umar Fana will never make a news. Now, I don't have to tell again. Me this and put her directly to the APC party. One of the things we, we lack, because we are member of the APC party, who they allow us to blame for taking things so we don't take out of context. They will take down for take out of context so they might take them. I will name them. I will name few things. When President Bill get in mind for call APC terrorist party, APC party not take out of context. Because they just took them, they're not taking out of context, they left them. President Bill go like Kalao District. He said the APC not let them people in that part of the country. They play the, that hate speech to the highest level. The APC party never take out of context. President Bill go like Kenya. Now, go like to care. He talk from when he begin for talk till he done that. They didn't talk. They don't take out of context. 
When I know the GTD report, the chief minister make a based on tribal line. It took tribal and uh, regional line. They don't take out of context. We don't see where the, where, where so many things that we don't do. Where the APC party for only make use of them. Okay, now we'll make a very simple. This doesn't kill him. Nah, 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 come away. Yeah. Very, very yeah. Um, you know, uh, I just want to say when you say out of context, because it goes like a city when they say take up out of context. But everything when they say it's enough for kind of like make APC kind of like talk about it well because already waiting they don't say it's it's like an embodiment of like who they are. So for say take up out of context, they tell people go tell like I say, Oh, we just want they they, they expect for make APC lie. But like the, the thing not supposed to be out of context. It's just that like APC you know they do enough for kind of like explain what in the thing actually mean what in they say. Because if you say out of context, they go like I say, maybe it's the same people go say, Oh well well why they could I make APC lie about it? Now just now just that's no, what they well, Yeah, no, not, not, not like that. Because if you if, if you know like not take anything out of context. Uh, uh, are given things here, the people will understand. Uh, the, the, the mayor you would you would accept you take out of context and nothing don't happen physically that be done we're not allowed to lie for them we'll be supposed to post the record and not doctor would you we it is not take out of context because these are things even a political party when they think then tell them to play it out of context then they put my gear pepper salt for like flavor proper one but if you look at them it's not a candy country because they increase small political tension in the high the, the country more high issue we don't understand them but the, but the political party gets a responsibility for all the government accountable for certain statements they don't do what they say. Okay. And they, they don't want to ever do a month for the party as, as a terrorist political party. So for go like Kalao, this is go talk to the APC one like one like today. Go like APC start Kalao, give them pump, give them, give them uh, solar light and make the room for them. They don't understand them. These are things showing the party. Not so, you know, you know they lie. If, if they, you don't bring them to light so that they will not see if these governments are mean business or not mean business. Now when you try to accuse her, Omar and Fufana, the reason to have is that uh, Joseph, uh, Joseph Salo go and audio leak where they talk about the party and where listen to the statement then, then they talk then the party is there because they say they, 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 they talk about their employees just as a problem. They go to the extent that they are points that they talk about the green. We want to follow them every talk about the BBC. You know, you know it was ourselves. Now let me tell you, let me tell you what you're talking about for the BBC. We want to follow first in red and mother blue that family will learn from bonds. I know if we don't take note, let me expose this thing back to that. Me that one person on 15, we're not going to block me that 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 Facebook. It block it block me through in my life because anybody who challenge them on Facebook, then they block you. When I go when all the 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 same number of people who are watching, they go and block you. If you this man be business, this man is really a honest Sierra Leonean. All it's not to that in the McKinney issue, the Parima Road issue, the one that happened in the lesser, the lesser side of Canada, where they kill people for law for, for, for level election. Oh, my father, not, 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 not going to be BBC. It's not going to play the people like that statement there. If you get all the audio, then. If you ever get a share of audio, where they leak audio, you play on BBC. Why are you not going to that audio that Canada? Where they just chat people there? Why are you not going to audio that Kunduru? Why are you not going to audio that Kalawu? Where they kill that boy? Why are you not going to come to the center? Why are you not playing Joseph, Joseph Salon in audio? Or why are you going to AID? When they go to the ICA, they are just a doctor, but so I don't be talking about BBC. You know, because we don't see this particular guy. You don't, you don't, you don't take Salah for granted that we don't accept him. But let me tell you something as well. So let's say for the day London, I played the Salah in London to the highest level that we are not, this is, we are not for politics because uh, United Kingdom, for God's sake, now they are colonial masters in the Britain. If we don't have the Salah, there are no only that you know, you know, like, that they are, that are the house of BBC. Look at what they say, the government was sitting against a woman for the BBC. They don't tell Salah, they don't understand. What else do you have to do? They are not people that 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 UK. Where does they realize them? Let us let's put APC or SFP out of this year. But when they say what's not in the saloon, what you might find is it's not right, it's not fine for the country at all. If the people in SFP like saloon, the men who follow SFP go to that. We tell this out of politics. We take her out of tribal, out of regional. We take her. We take her. The woman who follow the report. And then they give what you want to know that they know that they know that BBC and BBC the main head of this day at UK. The, I didn't talk about the APC players because they like, the, the APC that, 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 that UK, they are nothing. The only player who will work like from the data like that. I don't know what to say, I feel. The only other people that they are not put pressure by President Bill Gobert, if they are so the, 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 the UK, they put pressure. Like, so it's not cheap because from that state, Britain and the Korean side. So if you own out, sit down and comfortably, when they say, when they say, put it, you go to the 10 people. That means that they are lying. So all these things are the top thing because people, 
no, 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 Five years, after ten years, we we'll forget about the weather angle. We all don't narrow self to narrow thinking. So you need to be business. If you say not to be business, you go into business. Let me tell you something. When you blame man, the dust. If you blame man, you are blame man. You can dust that cloud. We don't say mess up. We don't mess up. We don't say 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 mess up. We but we don't allow them so much that they don't take this country out of context. They put a portion of me. Now they don't push for that and they talk about it because I don't need belong the APC. It's high time for the APC to challenge Umar for that to the highest level. It's high time the 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 that, that is what we be saying, even that I don't have the pain of SNP agenda. If you interview, you know, interview, you know, you get chance. If you get chance to interview the, 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 the local go, uh, government minister, why not to that interview? If you don't call actual why not why, 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 why not go, go to the own pro Congress? We're going to be policy secretary. We're going to say, why, why not call them? You, you know, the party don't need now for letting them take that challenge them. We will not say the time, but they need now for put the shoulder to the wheel. Let them tighten the belt. So that let the let the, the SFP and all the things that no matter let let them not see that that they get alone because if we like it or not, Ibrahim can force people forward. If we not talk today, one day, some day, sometimes we want to set to happen. Uh, you know, uh, comrade, thank you. And and, and and Cashbox, I don't know if you want to come in from your angle. I will bring in the people's power. I don't know, but but the, but but this is the thing, you know. Uh, because people, uh, uh, comrade mentioned this guy where they put that interview, the BBC interview. Now, guy, why we don't follow for quite a while? This Augustine Shengbe Mara, you know. But you see, comrade, like how we can talk and what we take with them for, you know, observe certain people the way they carry themselves. For make sure, say we not bring in the wrong people come within we fold because people are not consistent. And this Augustine Shengbe Mara, this guy, I don't even follow him. I even one day he tweet. I even take in tweet a share on my page. You know, I, 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 at some point, I thought about even doing a video on him, you know, for bringing the attention of some people into him. But thank God I don't do him. Because this interview, and then there was another, before this interview came, matter of fact, you can to recall BBC Pigeon, where they talk Creole, you look at language in any African country, then, 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 then they uh, uh, um, capture them at the bottom, so you, then it translates into English. Now they begin, and they listen to the guy, they talk about the cyber crime bill, it mentioned all the good side them for you know laundering money laundering let people not cancel the bill fine and this and that take each to the side we talk about you know who side and go arrest somebody in phone and this and that and all the stuff that they guy yeah, talk him um, it a mass mass side a mass mass um, and i watch the guy say mm. you know i looked at it i look if in previous post them about the issue the vehemence you know the feroc the ferocity where we get with the way they address the the issue and the way we begin melt melt them um, now say hey when I know say the SLPP, they no say them guy are all man and one of that country, all man white. So they get ready to do them for shutting down. But you know, uh, cash box or uh, uh, people's power, I don't know who's available. When I come in, bruh, because Umar Fofana, you know, it's about time the people of Sierra Leone, and again, Sierra Leoneans are in London. You say, you say, come here, this is the problem what we have. You see, Sierra Leone are one of the country where, when it comes to mobilization, we are poor in mobilization past any other African country. You know, look at the diaspora, let any other African country they say they organize a protest or whatever the case may be. Sierra Leoneans, it's thousands of thousands of Sierra Leoneans in the UK. Hey, but when I don't feel safe when I listen to the interview from BBC, Umaru Fofana, but when I, when I ask the warm self to the point where when I want to galvanize, when I don't want to put a dead self now, okay, now, now give you an say April 7 or April 8th. Is that too early? Or April 10th? When I organize a protest, everybody in the UK, the Sierra Leone, them. When I go in front of the BBC, when I go to map day, they can't come to the country talk. When BBC when I be, when I go and organize a protest in London, and now it's 10 person we're going to against Umar Fofana. How did he go get with? How are they going to look on us seriously? This guy, it's about time Umar Fofana, the APC as a political party, I don't call all the other one anymore, but APC as a political party, it's about time when I put una, all on a machinery, on an effort behind Umar Fofana for make sure say is hypocrisy. This lack of journalistic integrity is brought down once and for all. It is foolishness. It is stupid. People like us get 
I know how some of people they feel very frustrated. I know the way where people they feel right now, listening to Umaru Fofana, with all the important issues for this course. People are losing their lives. Now the chaplain and man ahead there. Look at the chaplain guy in the Kenema. Umaru Fofana, not make that in the news. Is that not newsworthy? Umaru Fofana is buying into the ideology of the SLPP, condoning violence, not reporting the effective news, the actual news, but for make up lies and tell stories them. We're not, we're not here. Talk to me. Talk to me, People's Power or Cashbox. Anybody, come in. Like us, what's kind? Push for Adeon, like us, what's kind? Okay. Catch it. You know, because, comrade, whilst we wait for it, we got there, you know, Marcela Samba, let me pay attention to Marcela Samba real quick, comrade. Marcela Samba is a civil society, and this is only to this compromise that has been going on for so long. People like McKinney die. Nobody, no, 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 talk about, no, no civil society, no talk about her. Marcela Samba, all the post violence. It, 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 <laughs> no, the problem about this, now, in the two sides, you say campaign for good governance. Exactly. So, now, right now. Exactly. Right now. Based on everything that not happen, you see that you see we go to call uh, rhetoric and reality. Based on rhetoric, we have instead of not in the line, this this appointment in the in the salon. Not we talk the chief minister go to say this apart in time. Not we talk up. The instead of come on says, and and man say. Salon is in a very good governance setup. In your in your civil society, they say campaign for good governance. All those things happen. So don't ever think that somebody will trap. If then they can't manage, they will not want anything. They get it trapped. They plan off. They will go to the government and say, "No, how they are going to do this?" Never mind them. Because for every person, they are doing their jobs. They will probably say, "Okay, talk this year." We talk. If talk and say, "Let him do business." What they don't do business in that at all, at all. And that is the thing. Exactly. It is a rhetoric. Exactly. Yeah. Not to do. recently. Because the party come out, SLP go independent. Not to not 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 to serious serious matters. Some people talk 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 for. They no chapter pull about about the law level by election. No two matters for talk for. Instead, I story do here. What do they get at this time? It doesn't like say when we will be in a parliament. When they try to look out there in prison, they appoint Momo Dia Steven as Supreme Court judge. The man they try somebody. If they if they try a serious case, they appoint a Supreme Court judge. So that man will be honest. So they get appointed to look in parliament court there. Now the same thing as Mr. Mandela. When we follow the ship, we are like the ship sailing. We know cash box will be booked in. You know. Uh, 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 whilst we're waiting on them, I'm saying cash box on a meeting or something. But whilst we're waiting on them, comrade, you talk about you know uh, compromise there because Marcela Samba, there is something she's been kept quiet. Why are you for why are you for accept an appointment from the president? You know the office of the president comes with an enormous power. It is a very solemn office, and so you know I forget corrupted. No, allow the president for influence you in no way, shape, or form. Masala Samba accepting this position as peace commissioner. She's, she's, she accepts him because she, she has been silenced. So you're not going to report again on the issues that were pertinent, we matter. Matter of fact, because there are no state local council elections, they come. And we report the fact that Masala Samba is needed for the local council elections. That is why they know they, they, know, they, they accept this, this, this position. Yes. There is a problem there. There is a conflict of interest, and these are the things where the APC as a political party for for go after these people. These were the same people working APC hell of a time. Every day they didn't radio they talk about cool nonsense. They were working for the SLPP. Now the SLPP is in power, guys. Salon people, una open una eyes. Masela Samba he accept the appointment day because they don't shut him up. She has been shut up. When I go see an hour, they talk so. <laughs> Now the ethical self for letting you see who said you will be now 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 what are for for what are the voice of the voiceless? The ethical for letting you see who said you will tell the government for what you job on the government. No, 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 no. The ethical you know, because we're look at the, 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 the ethics of vision. I know if you if you don't say part of the ethics, if you work for government, because if, if, when, when you when you deal in a non-governmental organization, why the form non-governmental organization? Why government not get total control by you? Absolutely. The federal government, the federal government gets integrity. That means it's non-governmental organization. So Absolutely. Those government they pay. That means people they fund loans and they pay you. They fund even they pay you back to you for government. Exactly. So you able to as an as an independent somebody. Right. Right. On the two sides, who's 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 have to talk to. Exactly. If somebody that's who's have to get the job, other government, so it's difficult for them. Now she's protecting her job by protecting the flow of salary. Right. 
and that is the fact. A comrade, right? You know, the thing that be because people don't get more as Joseph Salon, we don't be able to know your formula na 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 not come until the second. Until the second. When would you leave? Is it so? If if it, if it ethical, then I don't know why the forces you fight because at least they say this. When they say government organization, they say no government, no government organization because I play you to as, as an independent somebody so that you won't do the correct thing for themselves to pull them very well. If he, he, I will be a civil society, say campaign for good governance, go to a peace commission and first be when when the government they pay you. In order for more integrity, absolutely. And comrade, like good points, this. Yeah, and, and and this is the yeah, thing. Oh, cash box okay. okay. And this is the thing. Marcel Samba, with a demand for CU letter of appointment, with a demand for CU remuneration, whatever your salary is, with a demand for CU Lani, let come out of the public domain. Let we know say you're no longer working for the campaign for good governance, you're no longer a civil society, but you're working for the government. Peace commissioner. What the hell is that? What the hell is that? You already get an organization, you get you in a civil society, you're already fighting for peace that I continue. Let you use this campaign for good governance to fight for the peace for maintainer. Why they forgive you, Peace Commissioner? It is a compromise. Cashbox, go ahead. And we for think about filing a lawsuit against the BBC in London. APC should be thinking about filing a lawsuit against the BBC in London at this point. And Umar Fofana forbid the plaintiff. Go ahead, uh, Cashbox. Absolutely, uh, Ibrahim. And sorry, I think I'll be, I'll be just the driver and, and I'm not walking today. It's bank holiday today. Um, you see, you see the point, Naya, the crucial point, Naya, Ibrahim. Yes, a uh, comrade get right for blame the people in London and all that. And but you know what? It, it, like, you just hit the nail right there when you talk about the APC acting as a political party where they kind of like write a letter just to these people, uh, they, they, the BBC, you know, I'm not going to say something, but like, I, I, I know say I don't get connection with the BBC directly, and I don't want to say who's kind connection. I know how them people lay at the BA. And you know, the, 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 if APC set upon themselves as a political party and lodge a complaint to like the BBC trust, trust me, it will go a long, long way. You know, um, um, Ibrahim and Kumbu Kweta are people's power. Ibrahim, you talk about, say, um, um, Umar Ukofana being a freelance um, reporter. In fact, when you are a freelance reporter, in fact, that's the time, because when you are a freelance reporter, you, they, they, they pay you based on what you report. So there have been so many cases there where if uh, Umar Ukofana could not make so much money, what we call it, it is serious, because in a freelance reporter, they didn't pay him every month. When you're a freelance reporter, you don't need a salary. I, I do not pay as you go. So I, I pay as you report. Now, so then they pay you. So in other words, Umar Ukofana could not even make more money. They would they mess with the go on now. We can't eat. That but means... You make so much money. Because... Right, that means, yeah, he's making, uh, that means he's making some money up so other place them for make up for the loss exactly that BBC. So. Go ahead, Cash Exactly so. Exactly so. Like that's exactly where like when they have this kind of build on for say because it they lose money based on the freelancing, now it they make money on the side and USA they make the money on the side. That the government. We see USA in a position where they were full, where company they talk say like it don't block them and all that thing and they you know that you know where, where are, you know our point out now, yeah? as a you know, as a freelancer, you, like before I come to the other point, as a freelancer, you they make money based on the, the like the reports that we usually do. So many things that don't happen for me. This guy don't make thousands of pounds from the BBC. Yes, I understand the fact that when you go to the BBC say our report this, they can get certain departments the way they kind of like scrutinize and say, okay, is this worth based on like the, the, the report that we get now, yeah? Is this worth kind of like and this is where the APC as the party kind of like they step in and write to the BBC Trust and say the loss of life they the no more important party that talk about racism. Um, the loss of life, life and I'm kidding, the loss of more than perhaps you want to talk about like the racism that, that, that about for the mayor, the loss Trump, of Trump, Trump charge of tribalism. 
trumped up charges because these exactly. are all trumped up charges exactly. machinated by the state exactly. where they, they watch what they do they are the tribalists they are the nepotists that are in the damage we country exactly. look all the appointment them look all the ministerial positions them over the phone has never reported yeah. on that now go after one after the other exactly. every ministry you'll see go ahead cash box yes you see Ibrahim. you know look me me papa me mama be beat me for one thing with abedin go when Mr. Chem Wicked, I cannot go out and play, then I come back in the house, either me upset one or Saint Chem, like, you know, affect. Then my mama can kind of like tell me, say, well, ask me why I, I actually vex or why I affect or all anything in it. Then I will talk, say, oh, now the person is costing my mama. You know the question that my mama can always ask me? Is there are two questions they ask me. It is say, first of all, now you the cost. Secondly, it is say you a right now you pay. Why I give this example? You know that the fact that when somebody use a word, word and life was one better. When you they kill somebody, and when somebody utter a word, was one worse for make Uma Ukopana report na BBC. And this are the same because because my mama said me say a right now you pay. He left mark on your body when the person cost you. That's the thing that people tell you, say, this is not just mark or not to die, the person die. And when my mama not ask me if I die, he asked me if the mark left on my body. That's the thing that tell me, say, the wound is there when people are not wound in that country. The, 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 the killing is there when they are not that country. They want to come out they kind of like set a blind eyes on, and like just a rhetoric, just like a falsified, this, so see, when they, when I stop and say, when they take, when they take out of context, like now, Uma Ukopana, they report on anything they are. You know, they don't use the, um, 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 the civil society protest. It did not work. They use, um, what is again? Like, um, 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 the, the press conference, the, 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 the press release, it did not work. Now, they don't use Uma Ukopana now because they want to amplify this thing. And it's so not going to work. Level. It's not going to work. Matter of fact, exactly. it just aggravates me more. Absolutely. You see, it, look, if I have to create people's power, we can't eat as we can the talk. Until we build and strengthen we institutions them, we just they, 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 they waste powder can pack on door for make that country to go before. This is a disgrace. This is a mess. Like we can't see it's in a complete mess. We we fumble them not alone. If we I cannot wait for make this government clear out for make we fix that country. Day. I'm yearning for when this government get out for make we fix that country. Day. For the good of we begin and for the good of we you, the other the, the, the papa and mama, when they struggle for make life another country. Day. I cannot wait because some of these things, like the people in the see through me, what are we doing for fix we can't give it bamboo them? We for fix salon, you know get out of reach. Salon is fixed one, just there, some side, who say we just the worker, we have girls, we step them, they go pick up, if only we can see it. These people are not good for our country. These people are not objective, no integrity, as long as they get their money. Oh, 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 you can make better money, you like when you freelance it, if you report everything, then with the, with everything, then with the government that comes to it. But what you have you they sacrifice your freelancing money just because you know, say, there are better deals when the government they give you. Over to you, Ibrahim. Thank you, Kashmir. And, and the other thing, let me tell you something. Uh, for uh, this country that comes to a country, the country we don't, we don't fit to, well, the team of the law, the problem, they may take today. Don't show that to the next killing them, and then let's balance them. Now, a very serious thing I look for, 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 for the man people like, out there say, based on what's happening, what the killing will happen by law level election. Oh, I'm going to make the news say, if this continues to what's going to happen in this local council of presidential election in 2023. Because you get you, you access the level of danger where, where they are ahead of you, those are what they are put you pregnantly. If you want to be surprised, you don't tell you automatically in 2023, we're going to be more bloody than this one. Because this one, if the party are fighting within themselves, killing people, party members within themselves, what's going to happen between the opponent parties? Even if I don't know where my reporter is, it's the only thing I tell you, something that they mean are very strong and I get like BBC, we need for put BBC on the tools for that they give a reporter they pay by month, we need to nationalists where they can't be as alone we try and because let me tell you something what we're going to do move, move forward as a nation because look come out for now there is Sierra Leone where is that where is this as alone 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 where
now that in the you know, not mortgage is coming to that in the use for the money the past government for batting on Alex Kuma, for batting on the APC, anything who know how be one during the APC term. You will report two, three times per week. You go thirty dollars for Thomas. You go to prison. You have to pull a caution. They will not report that. You go do all kinds of But now, Omar Ufana, a whole you go pass two, three months. Me, I've never been able to pay. See, by now, I'm in a jail. We don't see. I'm going to be report on with issue. But Omar Ufana, do you know me? I need. I need to talk about myself. This one, I think, well, this is important. If Omar Ufana not see he he was alone, he he will be a better representation. The people are looking for stand up and see enough is enough if I hate. Absolutely, comrade. And, and this brings brings me to a point now, comrade, around for me very loud and clear. I see a video yesterday where they share where somebody now statistics say alone, you know, where they fire people them. Where the guy they call, all the last name them, nothing, nothing, nothing. Then they give people and they, they sack letter them. And I want to say this because I can understand why you said the APC, they don't learn the lesson. With the way we then treat people them across the country, fairly as Sierra Leoneans, during the days of the APC. A lot of these guys, state of Francis Ben Kaifala, they are. They all get a scholarship them through the APC. APC not even help their own northern brothers them if we for put an away. Because a lot of these guys, matter of fact, they say, no, me not help me brother, they'll be going to go send a nepotism just now. So what they end up for the do? Because they may be afraid the, the civil societies them, the Francis Ben Kaifala, they all, you know, so they get a renaissance movement and all that stuff that they did, where they used for pressurize the APC, for subdue the APC, for subjugate the APC. That was what they did. So the APC be afraid, not for doing kind of a thing they did. So this is what I'm going to tell the APC. Because I know when APC come back to power in 2023, it's going to be a cycle of getting rid of all of these people left, where they can put so now in the cathedral because like I can talk and come recruit her. Una all where they can so that they can put put fire fire people if we can put so on the job then they where government change you all in the fire on the back. When I tell you now you think now the APC so then this is their strategy. They say ah they were all left there, we need to talk to them. Let them try no more. When we can power, we don't learn we listen. We know how to deal with them, we know how to treat them. So that is the fear that I have. And believe it or not, all the people they are. Now, if the APC not take stance against this SFPP government, let it go down on the records, let it go down on the archive for say yes, these things were happening. These kinds of sacking governments will place them, then they sack people them based on tribal lines. If they're not stand up now, it's gonna be a problem. So this is the issue where we get for point out. This is why the APC get for take on Umaru Fofana and take on the BBC. One on one now. This is not the opposition, the biggest opposition of the country, the APC as a political party, they challenge the reporting of Umaru Fofana when it comes to picking and choosing what he, he, he reports. These are the facts. And, and, and I want the, 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 the APC and all the other opposition, because the government will come, this is about sabotaging a democracy. And that should not be the case. And we cannot sit back and allow these people to sabotage us at all under no circumstances. We work too hard. Umaru Fofana and I say more reports now about the war. And then they see all the post-violence elections, them is not doing anything about it. APC as a political party, it's about time we are using our machines for come up to these guys. Yeah, before, yeah, before, let me just let me just let, let me just do uh, do this as you close here. Uh, uh, what I look, you don't see him. I get I, I, I get an audio with a right up. They say from the Mende uh, Union, we the time for tell only the people that future, like the two or anybody that Mende never pay dues to the city, to the city, to the to the, to the future city council. I know we don't see them. I don't see things sway, you don't go viral. I will follow to you. Woman for no 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 play this year. This is say from the Mende Union that any Mende they leave that future never pay dues to the future city council. If the for people I say, may I can say she was just voted for be the mid of future, not to get the council. Now the federal NC, the castle gets touched them. They go they will not be there already. So they they not pay this to the fiscal city gas let they even pay the the workers them. For tell you see, they are they, 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 these are the highest level of tribalists. I see that the next expose themselves, the kind of racist there, he wants to expose themselves under Donald Trump. Now tell us your alliance, no look at what they happy presently. If we want to say one new tribe, we have been the tribe, not all me day, I always talk as all me day. The few one they will be say, then they think Sierra Leone. Then they, but the majority of them, they will have dedicated to come out of the then they are then on salon. Then they go like that, they go so loud. If the men they say, then the men they union. They are all saying they don't appeal to future discussion. Automatically, they understand the future not to the South City. Future, a day that is an extension of the North and Western area. So, meaning, you get to take your own to move and go, go like a boy or whatever. You know, this all, not this way, because this is the orchestrator by itself. Anything that they talk about, they understand it. 
then they, all they took are a party office. Right. That's what they call a party office. Then they call the like public. They are told they make out an audio, say, anybody who has been told they leave that future, they will pay tax to the future to the gas. They mean they uh, business who are not pay tax to the future to the gas. Well, this is how it's a challenge to him for like this. If somebody that future is not pay tax, what let's tell say, you are an elected person just like President Bill, nobody will fully do it. That means that local government will go into action. You never know yourself. You know, you know, appoint that point to you. You are not an elected somebody. Actually, I put them for the highest good step of future, but they don't have So, now, one let you know, see, let yourself know, see, since the world's pretty on end, anybody who sell that future in that future is subdued to the future city council acting for pay in due step. Till we meet again, God bless Sierra Leone and God save Sierra Leone. Thank you, Governor Kuta. Salut, people. What is the solution moving forward? Now, the government and the APC, as the biggest opposition, should go after the BBC and Umaru Fofana. They should file a lawsuit if possible, but for write a detailed letter outlining all the issues that have been happening over the years where Umaru Fofana failed formation. I think that is a cause of action. And they will forget a class action lawsuit against the BBC, Sierra Leone and the United Kingdom, where they ask Una, Una come together and file a lawsuit against Umaru Fofana and the BBC Trust, because these guys, we have to hit them where it's hard, where it hurts. That the fact that so we left this message now today. We want to talk about nothing else. This is about Umaru Fofana destabilizing the democracy and everything that we fought for. Cashbox, go ahead. Just before you close, by the way, you did not remind people about the number of days for election. But local oh, election, yes. I think it's 300 days. And then I think you, you have the, the, the general election um, uh, somewhere, yeah. isn't it? Right, 731. So, okay. Yes. And, uh, yeah, just, I mean, you can, you can close it there, but it's 366 for local election. Just before we go, may I just remind people about the Marcella Samba issue when you come up with? Right. If you remember, like, there are like there, things now, we have rumors they go out say this current government want to postpone the, the, the local um, um, council election. Uh -huh. So, this is, and Marcella Samba was supposed to don't begin, they talk about the local election next year. You find out, say, and you they remind them every morning, now it don't go quiet about it. That this is because, like, they don't have here this peace commissioner or whatever. Right. These are all kind of the integrity with their people they had to compromise just because of their own pocket. Thank you very much. And if I'm to have a very good day. All right. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. Um, uh, what I want for Dusef Naya? I want for play the uh, report of Umaru Fofana and then we'll close the message, Fambulem. When I listen to the Umaru Fofana report, they are close the message now. It's about four minutes. They will close this message. When I listen to her. Yvonne Akisoya is in the center of a huge controversy after remarks she made to her APC party members were leaked to the public. Her critics accuse her of making a tribalistic slur against the Mendes, one of Sierra Leone's major ethnic groups and from which the governing SLPP party draws much of its support. Umaru Fofana reports from Freetown. In the leaked audio, Yvonne Akisoya discusses political strategy with allies from the main opposition APC party, to which she belongs. Among other things, she talks about recent recruitment of council workers by the central government, something she says is wrong and not in accordance with procedure. But it is this bit of the audio that has created a storm here. Here, she mentions one of those staff, Mr. Kemokai, and says she doesn't want to work with someone whom, when she gives them an instruction, they will say, Bua Bise, a reference to a greeting in Mende, the language and name of the predominant ethnic group from which the ruling SLPP party draws its support. Consequently, there has been a backlash with some Mendes accusing her of an ethnic slur. Mayor Akisoya has rejected the accusations and apologized for her remarks in an interview on a local TV, AYV. I'm 53 years old. I think if I was tribalistic, it would have come out by now. There is nothing in my whole life that I've ever done, ever engaged. But I don't mind where anybody comes from. It wasn't based on tribalism based on frustration. And what I did yesterday was to apologize for the hurt caused by the presentation of the audio and the flippant remark, you know, um, has, has no one ever made a flippant remark when they're angry? No. 
Despite this, there are calls for her to step down by those who say that someone in her position should be mindful of the current toxic mix of politics and ethnicity. Augustine Sembemara is a respected lawyer and governance activist. The comments from the audio were pretty incendiary. We live in a society with so much discontent and such comments could, could spark flames. And we have very many social problems, so I think that um, our leaders should unify our country, should unify our nation, and not dismember or tear it apart. And the resignation is the only way for you? I think so. I think because the standards we set for our leaders should be very high, I think she um, fell short of those standards. And I think as a leader, if you fall short of a uh, certain standard, my call is for well, resignation. There have been um, conflicting messages from, from our office, from a person. Uh, you know, some stage said it was edited. She has said that it was taken out of context. So we don't know which is which. For someone who would usually easily accept my interview requests, three days of efforts to talk to the mayor proved futile. She would not answer my calls. She responded to only one of my three messages by forwarding to me a previously released statement. In it, she says she was presented out of context and her voice edited. But the Minister of Local Government, Tambalamina, who supervises local councils, has spoken to me. Deeply shocking. It's concerning that the mayor of the capital city, the seat of government, could make such disparaging remarks, uh, discriminatory remarks. What came out from this audio is that the administration in FCC, mainly the mayor, has made statements and bragging about those statements uh, relating to how she's actually rejected staff based on their ethnicity, which goes against the grain of, of the constitution and ethnic cohesion uh, is not the sort of, sort of statements that anybody who is in leadership should make uh, in the current day that we live in. The women's wing of the main opposition APC party has backed the mayor, calling the whole affair a political witch hunt. So for now at least, it seems the embers will continue to smolder. Umaru Fofana reporting that all right guys so i don't see the aggravation on i see the deceit on i see the disrepute when umaru fofana they bring come to we mayor because this guy with everything that has to be reported a left arm now this one also even news the mayor simply say then people they had to go bring the people in kafula can give their work that was it the president will go to him up like he sit on and talk all the nonsense we talk when a tribal and hates to the highest order the chief minister we say party time umaru fofana never reported people are getting killed Political non tolerance at the southeast, the chapter people they hate them. Umaru Fufana, not a reporter. Now, this nonsense. Now, in the machine it for bring down the good name of the mayor. Salon people of the left and I are. Will they wait for the lawsuit? Will they wait for actions from the APC as a political party for take on Umaru Fufana once and for all and say enough is enough of this foolishness? Bye bye.